Yeah. All right. So just do one more plank, uh, starting now. Still a minute? Yep. Yep, still a minute. <laughs> it doesn't have to be though, if you can't, if you don't want to, that's fine. We're just starting out, getting a rough idea at the moment. No worries. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Brilliant. Well done. So that's the end of our exercises. Um, well done. Did really, really well there. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that. Now, like I said before, to avoid any issues or prevent injuries, avoid injuries in the future, we're obviously going to warm up. We've done the exercises. It's now time to do the cool down. So all I want to do is just some static stretches. We're just going to choose five. Um, so first one, all we're going to do is our chest, uh, shoulder exercise. Sorry, not chest, shoulder exercise. So you have a choice here. You can either have it where one arm is directly across your chest, and then the other arm is bringing that arm closer to your chest. Hold that and squeeze. This arm is squeezing the straight arm. You should really feel a stretch in the shoulder here. The other option is to try and pretend as if you're trying to bring your hand as far down your spine as possible. From here, what we'll do is we'll bring that arm down, grab this other hand, hold the elbow, hold it down. And then we'll hold that for 10 seconds. It's up to you which one you'd like to do, but we'll hold that for 10 seconds starting now. Three, two, one, and swap. Three, two, one. All right, chest stretch. So nice and easy. All I want you to do is to interlock your fingers behind you. And from here, try and lift the arms away from your spine, basically away from the bum area. From here, as you're doing that, really puff out that chest, get your chest out high and proud. And the idea is you're gonna be stretching this area here. So we'll hold that for 10 seconds, starting now. All right, great job, well done. Um, so we're just going to work now down to the leg area. So the muscles at the front here are known as quadriceps. The muscles at the back here, they're known as hamstrings. And then your ones right on the bottom here, these are known as calves. Now, all I want us to do is stretch those. So with the quads, all I want us to do is have one foot firmly planted on the ground. The other one, you're going to try and grab and dig that heel into your glute. Doesn't matter which leg you start with, but dig the other heel into your glute and hold that for 10 seconds. Now I'm quite happy to balance here as is, but considering you've got that back wall, you're more than welcome to use that as a balance. So from here, hold one side, hold that for 10. When we've hit 10 seconds, we'll then swap over. All right, so we'll start that in three, two, one, and go. Three, two, one. All right, and swap. All right, brilliant. So I said before, we're gonna be working the quadriceps, 
and then the hamstrings and then the calf. So hamstrings, all I want you to do is just pretend as if you're walking forward. But in that stride, stop here. From here, what I then want you to do is to just slowly kneel into your bent knee and then you'll feel a real stretch in the hamstring. I just want you to hold that for 10 seconds. As soon as we've done that, we will then swap legs. So as I said, give me a bit more space here. So I have one foot slightly in front of the other. Bend backwards if you're almost about to sit on a chair. Bend the other knee. Keep one leg straight because you'll be stretching the straight legs hamstring. We'll start that now. Three, two, one, and swap. Three, two, one. All right, last but not least, we're gonna now do uh, the calves. So from here, all I want you to do is kind of like the hamstring to a point, just have one foot in front of the other. The difference is though, I want you to have a slight bend, whatever foot you put forward first, have a slight bend in that front knee. Don't just lean forward like this. Keep yourself straight, have a slight bend in that front knee. And the idea is that my back leg keeps straight, but also try and keep that back heel down. So, because the idea is that if you move forward and you lift, you're tightening the calf, you are not stretching it. So to avoid that, keep that foot down, keep that back heel down, press in, and then we'll hold that for 10 seconds. Yeah. Three, two, one, and swap. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done. Really Thank well you. Done. No, you did absolutely amazing there. I uh, hope you Thank enjoyed you. that. So that's our first strength workout. Uh, awesome. So uh, we'll book you in. We've got you booked in here by the looks of it for the 3rd of July uh, at 11 a.m. So I'll be on next session. But for now, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, like I said, it's just a foundation, just a start, give you a rough idea of what, kind of it's about how we can progress from here the alternatives i've given you you can kind of get a rough idea of what the progression will be over time okay awesome thank you connor no worries i will see you soon bye